Once uh, the, the, the provisional restoration is ready, we recall, the, we recall the patient and usually this happens like 24 hours after the surgery. We will see in this particular slide the protocol that we use when we deliver the immediate temporization. You can see we remove the healing abutment. This is not Armando, but it's another patient, but the protocol doesn't change. We remove the healing caps, we remove the suture, we are we trying the upper and the lower provisional, we try all the we try the function as you can see down here. But what I want you to focus on in this slide is on the face of the patient that uh, you can see there is no swelling, she did not have any pain and uh, she's happy with this provisional restoration. On the right side, that uh, right now the balance, if we compare it to the initial situation, is much better. The white and the pink balance, and Armando is much happier than the beginning with his temporary in place. And you can see also in Armando, no pain, no swelling, no bruises. So this is what this is why we try to avoid to elevate big flaps. This is why we try to have only one surgical steps. And also we met Armando's request not to having him wearing a removable prosthesis even for one day.